in a healthy body, when we eat, the vagus nerves are excited, and the excitement of the vagus nerves can help increase the insulin level, and the insulin can help the cells get more blood sugar, and then they lower the blood sugar level. If the person has an accident when they're young, they can damage the vagus nerves and only let the sympathetic nerves working. And then the insulin level will drop or not exist. Then cause the high blood sugar and then cause the diabetes. Dr. Zhao has found that there is a great link between the neck injury and the vagus nerve damage. Okay, let's see a patient and tell about the history of his diabetes. Okay, Tia. Tia, yes? Tanya. Tanya. Tanya, so my, my English, mm -hmm. not Tanya, because I first time read this name. Okay, Tanya. So, you said when you was a baby, you had a car accident. Yeah. And then when you between one and between ten, you have another two car accident. Mm -hmm. And then since then you have a, I think a long time ago you said this, this neck pain been over five years, isn't it? Yes. And then also you had the this lovely. Uh, Love the machine on your arm is put in your skin and then test your blood sugar, isn't it? Yeah. It's for your blood sugar test. Yeah. And uh, send the sig send the signal to your phone. That's very high technology. And also you said. Uh, when you was young, eleven, you found the diabetes. Yeah, eleven. And then the doctor said, oh, sometimes you in, in your insulin level is more, and sometimes. L less, yes. isn't it? Yeah. So that proves one of my theory. So when you were young, you had a car accident, and that car accident damaged your neck, which is caused you pain now. Even you have a terrible neck pain mm -hmm. and uh, make you headache. Yeah. You describe your your yeah. neck pain. Yeah. It's um, pre like you said, predominantly on the left, but it it gives me headaches. It causes pins and needles on, on my arms. arms. Yeah. It, it makes me feel like heavy. Yeah, it, it almost. I always thought that my neck needed to be taller, needed, yeah, needed to, to be, be pulled, pulled up. Yeah, yeah always. And, and I also stretched I, up. Yeah, yeah. and uh, uh, then uh, you had uh, diabetes. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, my theory. It's uh, uh, diabetes caused by the when you're young have a neck injury and then damage the nerves. In your, mm. in which is control is the uh, vagus nerves, all right? Damage the vagus nerves, which control your uh, insulin yeah. level. Uh, yeah. What is the pancreas? Yeah. Pancreas don't have the order from your brain. Then they don't work, mm -hmm. and then they have the insulin difficulty. So then you have to use the uh, insulin pump in, and when you eat or when you have the high blood sugar le level, you have to use the insulin. And uh, so suppose my treatment, I recall that, so reduce your insulin taking and uh, rising up your pancreas function. Mm -hmm. Could be, all right? You test it in the future. Yeah. You, you, you compare with your monitor because you have a phone record mm -hmm. of my insulin level before. And now my insulin level is uh, like uh, rising up or whatever. Okay, yeah. so we, we do a test and yeah. then we have a proof of the theory. As well as, okay, I, I have to give you maybe five minutes neck massage, isn't it? And how do you feel now? Oh, Compared? yeah, I, it feels so much different already. <laughs> yeah, move your head. Yeah, and I feel light. Yeah, and it's not, it's not clicking, cracking anymore. Yeah. It, it used to do it every time I moved, it would crack. Yeah, yeah. and so. you feel head, not headache anymore. No, no, does, no, it doesn't feel as heavy as it did either. Yeah, okay, right, okay, that's great. Okay, now I continue your treatment, okay?